Hey guys, Jason here with Quantum Courses, and in this video, we'll be going over how to integrate Printful with your Shopify store, and how to add your first product. Connecting Printful with Shopify is one of the easiest ways to get started with dropshipping. You can use Printful to create high quality products such as t-shirts, swimwear, or even jewelry, and use Shopify to sell your products to your customers. Once you design your products and add them to your Shopify store, you can focus on marketing your business and let Printful handle the inventory storage, production, and shipping to your customers. So let's go over the process to connect Printful with Shopify and add your products to your Shopify store. If you haven't signed up to Printful yet, you can support this channel by clicking the link in the description and create your free Printful account to start your dropshipping store on Shopify. Once you've created your free account, you want to log in and we're going to look at the menu on the left hand side. To connect Printful with Shopify, we're going to start by clicking on the Stores tab. Here's where you can select to connect Printful with a platform, a ship station, or create an API. Let's click on Choose Platform. Here's where you can see all the various e-commerce platforms that you could choose to add Printful to. But for this video, we'll be integrating Printful with our Shopify store. So let's go over to the Shopify option and click the Connect button. This should take you over to the Shopify App Store where you can view the Printful print-on-demand Shopify app. Here you can learn more about the features offered by the app and how you can install it for free in order to drop ship products on Shopify. So before we install the app, go ahead and log into your Shopify store. Go up to the top right and click on the blue login button. You should see a box pop up so you can log into your store. Now that we've logged into Shopify, let's click on the blue add app button. You will then be taken over to Shopify where you can confirm the install of the Printful print-on-demand app. You will be able to use the Printful app to manage your products, manage your orders, and manage your online store. Go ahead and go down and click on the install app button. Now that we've installed the app, you're now going to connect your store with Printful. You should have already created your Printful account at the beginning of the video, so go ahead and type in your email and password and click on sign in. You're now going to confirm the connection. Go ahead and click on the red connect button. And there we have it. Printful has now been added to your Shopify store. So now that we've connected Printful with our Shopify store, let's go over the process to add our first product. I'm simply going to scroll down and click on the red add product button. This should open up a page right inside of your Shopify store where you can create new products, view your previously created products, and view your warehouse items. Under the new products tab, you can search through all the different products that are offered by Printful and start designing the ones that you want to add to your store. This is a great way to quickly build up your Shopify store to start offering dropship products. But for this example, let's click on the My Product Templates tab and add a product that I've already designed. I want to add my martial art lifestyle t-shirt to my Shopify store, so let's go over the process to do that now. Under My Product Templates, let's select the product that I want to add, then go down and click on Continue. This should take you to a page where you can start editing your product details. From here, you can select the different colors that you want to offer, select your product sizes, or edit your product print files. Once you're ready, go ahead and click on Proceed to Mockups. Here you can select from a variety of different mockups that you can display on your Shopify store. Go ahead and browse through the different mockups and select the ones that you want to use for your product. Once you're ready, go ahead and click on Proceed to Description. Here's where you can select the language for your description, create your product title, and write a detailed description of your product. Some product details will be automatically pulled from Printful and added to your product title and description, but if you want to change it or add more, feel free to do so here. Once you've selected a language and added your product title and description, you can then scroll down and edit your size guide. You can choose whether or not to display the size guide on your product description and choose the measurement system. You can select from Imperial or Metric. A preview of the size guide is also displayed here. Next, you can add your product tags. These are keywords that are associated with this product. If you're adding multiple keywords, simply separate them using commas. Under product visibility, you can select if you want to publish the product now and make it visible on your store. If you've already created some product collections on your Shopify store, you can also add the product to a collection if you like. And finally, you can select whether or not to display your product with free shipping on your storefront. Once you're finished, go ahead and click on Proceed to Pricing. Here's where you can edit the prices for your product. Here you can see the different sizes that are offered, the Printful price, 
the retail price that you'll charge the customer, and the profit that you'll make. Your profit is determined by the retail price minus the printful price. You can adjust your retail price for each size of your product, and when you adjust the retail price, you'll see the profit column update as well. Once you finish updating the retail price for each size of your product, go ahead and click on the Submit to Store button. The product should now start uploading to your Shopify store. And there we have it. We've just added our first product. If you wanted to add another product, simply click on the Add Product button. So let's take a look at the new t-shirt design that I just added to my Shopify store. So here's what the product sales page for my new t-shirt design will look like when customers visit my Shopify store. We can see all the different colors that I selected to add, and we can see all the different sizes that I selected to offer. We can also view the product title, the price, our description, and our size guide. When customers are ready to check out, they can click on the Add to Cart button, and the product will be added to their shopping cart. Once they're finished shopping, they can click on Check Out, they can enter their information, and have the product drop shipped to their shipping address. Printful will handle the product production and the shipment to the customer, and you'll get your share of the profit. If you needed to update your product on Shopify, simply click on the Products tab on the left-hand side. You can then select the product you wish to update, and edit your product title, description, tags, and other information. You can also update other details such as the product type, which can help you sort your products, change the vendor name, or add it to a collection. You can add more images and update your variants such as the colors you offer, the sizes, and the price for each size. If you wanted to delete a product, simply go down to the bottom here and click on the red delete product button. So that's the process of integrating Printful with your Shopify store and how to add your first product. To get more Printful tutorials, make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit that like button. I'll see you next time. Hey guys, Jason here with Quantum Courses and thanks for checking out this short video preview. To get the full course and view our other online courses and masterclasses, head over to jasongandy.org or click the link down in the description. Don't forget to subscribe and click that like button and I'll see you in the next video.